This video is a follow-up from yesterday, so if you haven't seen that, hit that link up in the corner and definitely watch that first. But it looks like AMD's next generation RDNA 3 Navi 3X GPUs for Radeon gaming graphics cards are going to feature a much bigger gen over gen performance increase. Following up on his AMD Navi 33 GPU story, Kitty Yuko has now revealed that the flagship Navi 31 GPU is going to be one insanely powerful chip. Like the Navi 33 GPU, which we reported on yesterday, the AMD Navi 31 GPU will also be based on the RDNA 3 GFX 11 GPU IP. Now the Navi 31 GPU will be replacing the current flagship, which is Navi 21, and will be almost twice as large considering it's going to feature a dual chiplet design. We all can think of the current big Navi, Navi 21 GPU, as being insanely powerful chip. But based on these rumors, we're now hearing that the next generation parts, Big Navi 31 GPU is going to make us completely forget about the existing parts, almost like they were never really available at all. Well, in a reply to Paul from Red Gaming Tech, Kitty Yuko stated that a 2.5x performance jump for the AMD RDNA 3 based Navi 31 GPU is too little. This suggests that the next generation flagship could end up being almost three times faster than that of the Navi 21 GPU. And for comparison, the existing Navi 21 GPU features 80 compute units or 5,120 stream processors, and the chip also features Infinity Cache and has a die size of 520 mm square on the 7 nanometer process node. And the previous rumor for the Navi 33 GPU on the mainstream chip reveals that it would be replacing the RX 6800 and the RX 6900 offerings with a similar core count, and the new flagship is going to take things to the next level. You will be getting a dual 80 compute unit die, well, dies rather, each featuring 5,120 stream processors for a total of 10,240 stream processors. The AMD RDNA 3 based GPU from the Radeon RX GPU SKU will also be based on a brand new process node from TSMC, reportedly 5 nanometer, which is also going to result in a die space saving. Compared to TSMC's 7 nanometer node, the N5P or 5 nanometer delivers a 15% speed improvement or about a 30% reduction in power consumption. Now, other details from Red Gaming Tech suggest that the AMD Navi 31 GPU will feature ray tracing performance similar to NVIDIA's and Ampere GPUs, while the machine learning capabilities for technology such as Fidelity FX Super Resolution will be handled by low precision ops rather than dedicated hardware like tensor cores on the NVIDIA GPUs. Now, the AMD RDNA 3 Navi 3 GPU lineup of Radeon RX graphics cards will be competing with NVIDIA's own MCM GPUs based on Ada Lovelace GPUs. As of now, the next generation parts aren't expected until the end of 2022 or early 2023, so treat this information with the required grain of salt. And I want to thank you for making it to the end of this video. If you like what you've seen here and you like getting news daily, make sure you hit that subscribe button down there in the corner. And if you've missed out on news in the past and you want to catch those, check out one of these videos over here.